morning, my lovelies. How are you all? Um, we're on day two of uh, the Southwest Quilt Show uh, in New Nava. Um, we, it's up there, is it? Yeah. I oh, think I thought it was up at the cafe. end. Oh. Quilt displays. No, keep going down. Cafe's at the bottom. Um, so, yeah, it was a nice day yesterday. We saw lots of new people, which was lush. Oh, okay. Oh, I thought the cafe was up there. No, the left, you have to go in the oh, left Oh, we'll go up there way. then. All right, I, I haven't been there. She's telling me off. I was just... Whatever. Whatever. <laughs> I went there for cake. Uh, if you're coming, cake. try the cake. It's awesome. Really good jacket potato as well. I told them it was banging. It's got a lash us. Um, so, I said, I said to we'd take you round the quilt shows. Uh, the quilt shows... The actual quilts today. I so, where the quilts are, I haven't seen them. I think they're up here somewhere. Yeah, somebody said they were up here. So, we've got a nice little cafe area up here. I'm going to flip you around because you don't need to look at me. So, we've got this just got a nice cafe area. They did really good, very good cake, very good jacket potatoes. Um, apparently, the quilts are up here as well, but I'm not sure where. So, we're going to find them. Uh, morning, Freddie. How are you, my darling? Um, morning, Helen. So, yeah, I have to say, highly recommend uh, the jacket potato. It was delicious. But I'm trying to find out where the, where the quilts. Yeah, where would that be now? No, where's the quilts? Oh, the oh, quilts. Oh, I thought you were saying, where's the quilts, Abby? <laughs> <laughs> what, where I said they were? On the other side? Oh, I so I was right. I was right. The quilts were down the other end. I don't know why I ever think that she's not going to be. <laughs> right, so... The lift will probably shut Hello, down. how are you, darling? <laughs> right. I'm back. Oh, I'm always banned from quilt shows, lovely. Absolutely. Right, so we're going to go back downstairs. We're going to find the quilts. Um, what are you all doing this lovely Friday morning? It's still quite cold, but the sun's back out today. It feels quite nice. Uh, morning Jane, morning Anne, morning Maria, hi Eileen, hi Kate, um, oh, who else is there? Oh, lots of people, lovely, lovely. Right, we are, gonna, we are trying to find the quilts, sorry. I haven't found them yet because we were on the stand all day yesterday. It was quite cold in here, I have to say, and I wasn't appropriately dressed for it being cold. I'm boiling. You're boiling? Yeah, I'm absolutely, I'm thinking I'd take my clothes off. She's boiling. I'm just, I'm okay today. I've got about six layers on, but I'm okay. Hi, Marion. Right. Going to try and find the quilts for you guys. I don't know what she's doing. I think she's staring at the men's loose. Maybe she's hoping for, like, Chris Hemsworth to come out or something. So, quilt display. See, I knew it was down here. She just, she tells me I'm wrong and I know I'm right. <laughs> so, uh, did you get a foxy? I did get a little fox. I did absolutely get a fox. And um, I also got uh, Rex from Toy Story because he was really cute. <laughs> so, um, so yeah, um, I'm going to show you some of the quilts, okay? So, we're going to go down this way and I'm going to flip you around so that you can see some of these beauties. Ooh, so you can actually win this quilt. If you come and visit, you can buy a raffle ticket. Here we go. And... Oh, look at that beautiful quilt. Isn't it stunning? Really, really lovely. Hi, Taryn. So, some really nice, beautifully done, actually. Uh, needle turn. And then a nice little bit of quilting on it. Very pretty. I like the fact that they haven't bound it. They've faced it. Can you see they've just done a facing on it? Oh, it's double-sided. Well, not quite double-sided, but they've done that on the back, which is lovely. Um, Okay, so we've got some quilts here. I think there's more quilts. The quilts, I think, are up those stairs, maybe. Up those stairs. We've got some little... I'm giving second prize on this. So this were journal quilts, these ones. And uh, there's some really lovely work here, guys. Hi, Elizabeth. Really, I love those little swallows. That's beautifully done. Really nice, though. They've just used uh, those diagonal lines there and then a pliqued on top of it. Really, really nice. A little journal quilt. Those are beautifully done as well. Look at that. That looks like it's all been painted into as well. So that's called Home One and Home Two. Those are by Sharon Elliott. 
Oh my gorgeous. So I'm, oh, I'll show you these ones. I'm presuming, because there's loads of quilts here, I'm presuming they're all upstairs. I will find them. Oh, that's really interesting. I like that, that's called The Art of Wakefield. It's all um, Barbara Hepworth sculptures they've recreated. It's quite interesting, isn't it? I quite like that like, little bit of texture they've got in this one, that pleating. Hi, Holly. You've never seen those needle keepers before. Marion, they're amazing, aren't they? I'd quite like to stock some in the shop, actually. Because they're very, very cute, very pretty. And these are all parts of the journal quilts. Got a real warmth coming from that sunset, haven't you? Looks gorgeous. I like it a misty morning. Nice little bit of sort of um, tie dye and stuff dyeing they've done into that. If so, yeah. Lovely work on those um, thread painting on those puffins as well. Don't know if you can see. If I get really close, I'm not going to touch. But can you see they've like thread painted in it to create texture? gone backwards and forwards, backwards and forwards really quickly with uh, the machine in the direction they want the feathers to look. So yeah, really nice. So I think the rest of the quilts must be up here. It says they're up here, so we're gonna go up here, guys, all right? Follow me upstairs. Let's see if we can find the rest of them. Hmm? No, maybe not. I genuinely don't know where the rest are. I'm gonna have to speak to the people to Pete and go, where the hell are they all? Where are all the quilts? Because <laughs> I'm just wandering around now. This way? No, it's just bathrooms. I don't know where they all are. Right. I'm going to, I'm going to have to uh, find them. I don't think that's it. There's got to be more quilt displays than that. They normally have massive loads of quilts. Maybe they don't on this one. Jeannie, where's the rest of the quilts? Ah, not up the stairs. I've just been up those stairs and they don't go anywhere. these double doors here yeah, yeah. they're outside that's why i didn't know there we go right we're gonna go in a lift you might lose me hang on okay right up up we go let's have a look quilt displays on the first floor look it says just there now <laughs> Let me. might lose me in the lift so, so how are you all today? Is everybody okay? Are you, are you all all right? Anybody exciting? Who's coming to see us today? Oh, nearly there. I'll take you a little wander around New, New Navarre Race Course and there go. Oh, there we go. Quilt displays. There we go. Oh, oh, it's a bit of a trek, mind. There we go. Found them. <laughs> Hang on, let me flip you around. I'm getting the steps in today. I really am, love. I really am. Right, here we go. So these are Sandy Lush ones. I think you've probably seen these before, but who's who's not to love Sandy Lush's work? I mean, she is just a master of it. quilting, isn't she? Absolutely. Just the texture and all she gets into them. They're just amazing. So she's got all these beautiful, it's like a mystery tour. It really is Holly. <laughs> it really is a mystery tour. It's like, where am I going? What am I doing? Found him now though. <laughs> so these are all Sandy Lushes. They're just amazing. Can you, I don't know if that's coming across on screen, but the sun's coming through and you can like see every little detail in that stitching. And it's like it's machine done. She's so amazing. I'm in complete awe of her work. Love, really love, vampire emergency oh, Sorry, that's Sean just uh, texted Kate in. And then, oh, I'll come back down this one. So, shout if there's anything there. Thank you for the speed delivery of your... Ah, oh, that's brilliant. Do you know what? Those um, coronation blankets, they're basically out of stock everywhere. 
just can't find them. Oh, this is something new. We haven't seen this before. This is the mini quilt challenge, but we're out of stock. I'll never find Sarah again. I won't. I've no idea where my stand is. It's gone. So this was a, uh, this was to push boundaries of modern quilters. They were given a small bundle of fabrics, which was black, white, four shades of gray. They could add one other color if they wished and had to make a mini quilt. So these are really interesting, aren't they? Wow, look at the work in that one. That's very cool. Very, very cool. I like the way they've done a little uh, little portrait there. Done all sorts of, a little bit of long stitching, a bit like sashiko and stuff in there. That's, that's a really good effect, isn't it? You've got that real illusion happening there, like a little depth, like you could put your finger down in, in the holes. <laughs> oh, really nice little challenge that is. And then these are, oh, I'm really sorry, I'm going to butcher your name. Vendulka? Vendulka? She um, owns Olivan. There you go. I can never, I can never pronounce her name. I'm very sorry. I will have but butchered her name. But these are all a little exhibition of her work. Which is very lovely actually. Oh, and then these are quilts from Quart all from Fat Quarters. This is from pa Pam and Nikki Lintot's new book. And it's all just Fat Quarter. And I mean, look at those. Isn't that, that's so effective. Really big pieces. Be really fast to put together. Mm -hmm. Blah, blah, vampire emergency blah. <laughs> Sorry guys, that's, uh, that's Sarah and Sean having a chat. And they've got these beautiful, That I mean, that looks like it's, lit from behind doesn't it that, the colors on that are just incredible all calf facet fabrics sorry i'm very 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 snuffly today you have to excuse me it's really beautiful very simple just half square triangles and then you can see look you've got your half square triangles opposites and then these little blocks here, which again, really, really simple to do with nice, simple sashing, but so effective. Uh, Sheena, thanks for doing it. It's good to see. It's such an eye It's good to see what can be achieved. Ah, oh, you're new to it. Ah, oh, lovely, hun. Well, welcome to the dark side. We get everybody eventually. <laughs> and uh, you'll all be a fabric addicts before you know it. Again, really, really cute. Really pretty. Just like a little quarter square in the middle. All done like that. I think we've done that block actually on a one o'clock. Really nice. Simple stars, just done really big with a little bit of applique on them. I mean, how beautiful, like for a baby quilt or something like that, you know, really, really simple to do. Just with half square, again, all half square triangles. You've got half square triangles all put together, just how you put it together, and then just a little simple bit of applique on it. But how stunning is that? There we go. It's going to have a little wander down here. Sarah would like that. All the colours. All the colours. You love Sandy. Yeah, she's her work is just outstanding, isn't it? Really, really is outstanding. I'm just going to... There we go. This is... Uh, my maid, this quilt for her, my brother Gareth, and it was long-armed quilted. It's beautiful. Love those little stars. Little skinny stars. <laughs> So this is um, all work by Jill Hollinsworth. It's a retrospective. Um, ah, beautiful. Oh, she passed away in 2020 from a battle of cancer. And this is lots of stuff that she's done. Oh, how lovely. Oh, Jane, you've got to do it. Just do it, darling. Really nice rail fence quilt. Really simple. Can you see? Just one, two, so you'd cut your, sew your jelly roll in strips and then you'd cut them down to six and a half inch strip, uh, pieces and you've got one going that way, one going that way, one going that way, one going that way. And then on the next row, you alternate it so it goes down and then across and you end up with that beautiful rail fence. Very, very simple. Get yourself a jelly roll. Get on with it, guys, because that is easy, easy peasy. If you've never made a quilt, that's a lovely way to do it. That's beautiful too. I like the asymmetric way you've got that sort of um, little spiral happening through that lone star. Really good, isn't it? It's called an orchid star. And there's the details there, guys. 
Okay. And we're going to go down this side. Beautiful applique. And then again, she's thread painted and worked into it with a stitch in. Added, um, looks like she's painted into them as well. You know, we were using those ink tense pencils the other day. Looks like she's used those and painted into the fabric too. Oh, excuse me. I'm very, very snuffly. I do apologise with the sniffing. It's extra bad today. That really does look like you can like go into it, doesn't it? Like you could swim through there and go through. Although I'm not sure I'd want to... Uh, oh, mind you, he'd be nice for dinner with some butter, wouldn't he? That big lobster. Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> I like the way she breaks the, the frame with that little bit of applique there. Ah, oh, Sheena, yeah, have a go, darling. You know, make make one up in scraps until you kind of think, oh yeah, that's right, I've got it right, and then um, then send it in. It would be lovely. I I want as many people as possible, all you know, experiences to you know, ranges of ex levels of experience to send in. Doesn't matter if you're an absolute beginner, have a little go, darling, and then you'll be able to see it when we go to Harrogate, all hung up, like this. There we go. I've got riot of blue there like a sort of sampler quilt isn't it all put on point all the blocks have been turned and put on point and you've got a mixture of piecing and applique and stuff so yeah lovely and then you've got these beautiful oh it looks like sort of like cells and stuff you know under a microscope doesn't it and i think i've shown you these before these beautiful portraits which when you get up close to them now i'll show you when you get up close like really close to them they don't really look like much do they like the pieces don't really sort of you can kind of see their sort of a face and you pull back and suddenly it really does look like a person it's amazing isn't it really really cool i like that a lot and then you've got some more going down this side hi jean how are you my darling you love any purple quilts oh i don't blame you <laughs> here we go so um, I just looked at the time, so I should head back to the stand because I've got to find it again. <laughs> got to work out where I'm going. Um, was it this way? Where was the lift? Where was the... There's the lift. <laughs> so, oh, there we go. Hi. So, I'm going to head back to the stand now, darlings. Um, uh, Roxana is doing a little demo on her stand uh, on Hannah's room. It might, it might lose the signal. Level zero. So anyway, we found the quilts. Yoo-hoo! <laughs> we did find them. Um, so back in here, all done. Found them. <laughs> We're back in here now. <laughs> oh, what you are? You are in all your fat quarters. Sorry, God. <laughs> Jean, Jean, is, Jean has brought her iron in. Do you reckon I could get her to, to do mine for me? <laughs> no problem. She brought her iron in with her. So she's got a beautiful range of ooh, those are, all the beautiful linen textures and everything. Lots and lots of fat quarters. Ooh, awesome bits with script. You know what I'm like with script. So yeah, lots and lots of stuff down here. And we're going to head oh, going to head back over to um, to the stand. So. That's us for today, my darlings. We will see you all very soon. And like I said, I might try and pop on again later and see if I can do a sneak peek of um, Roxana doing her demo. Just saying that I'm going to try and, if you don't mind, I'm going to try and come over later and do a bit of your demo, do a bit of live demo in. With, you know, come and film your demo. So um, we'll, um, there we go. 11.30, I will try and come back as long as it's not, you know, hope, well, hopefully it's mega busy. But if it's not mega busy, I'll come over and we'll go live, okay? So um, we'll see you soon. Um, uh, am I sold out of the coronation? Yes, we are lovely. We we had um, 20 in and they sold out like that. Um, we're not likely to be able to get any more in. So Dara's saying they can get more of the colours. But if you drop us a message, we might be able to do the colours up in a different yarn or something. So they're the same colours, but we won't have any more of the labels. Hello. Um, Liz, if you get over 600 blocks, the quilt's going to be mahoosive. I'm going to have to double-side it, aren't I? I'm going to have to do it double-sided, Liz. So, um, 
so yes, anyway, I'm going to go because there's a nice little queue forming and there's a few people here. And let me just flip you around so you can see. So we've got a few people just arriving. So I will try and get back at 11.30 to Hannah's room stand. And we're going to, I'll do the demo. I'll do the live demo for you, okay? So take care. Bye.